Hi guys before we go into today's video so I want to ask you do you know this so that's how it's looking yeah mm -hmm. tell me oh do you know that oh today we are going to learn how to prepare that if you don't know it so today you are going to learn how to prepare that which is so delicious and so sweet for today's video so let's go deep in the video and we say how the day moved for me yeah so if you know it you can just comment down below in the comment section and tell me if you know it where where are you watching from and which country do you, do you know where is it is it the same country you are or it's another country where you know is it okay so let's go into this video and we see how it mode hi guys how are you good morning good afternoon good evening let me hope you are doing fine um i've just woke up now <laughs> it's almost 12 love yeah today is my day off and um i want to walk with you like uh, spend that day off with you today yeah by the way i really appreciate thanks so much i reached 7k thanks for support thanks for subscribing and thanks for following and seeing my videos yeah so i've just waked up i'm still in the bed but as today i have a lot and a lot of things to do i have i have to wash after washing when they dry i have to iron i have to cook you know when i'm off i do everything yeah because uh so i do everything which i'm supposed to be in the week which you are supposed to be in the week so everything i'm supposed to do in the week i do it when i'm off <laughs> so that's today <laughs> so my off goes around and around when i'm busy too yeah so uh, when i exactly when i wake up my day off is off it's already done yeah because when i wake up i have to cook i have to wash i have to clean or I sleep i have to do i rent this i rent this oh mg <laughs> so i've just wake up yeah so i'm going to be in the washroom i take shower after taking shower i'll be putting my clothes in the washroom so i'll be back and i see what are you going to eat to the breakfast i see what i'm going to pay prepare for the breakfast what i'm going to prepare for lunch and how is the day is going to move today so let me come back i'll first go rush in the washroom i take shower after taking shower i come back if you're new on my youtube channel please don't forget to subscribe like and comment down below i love you so much thanks for subscribing on my youtube channel so let me hurry up go washroom i take shower okay guys i'm back yeah i'm back from the washroom so we are going to go and do in the kitchen and see what we are going to prepare for today's breakfast. Yeah. So let me first tie this one. All right. Where's my lipstick? And this. Okay. Here we go. Mm. All right. So let's go in the kitchen and see what we're gonna have today for breakfast as the journey continues. Yeah. So I'm done with the washing. Just breakfast and lunch. That's the only thing which is remaining. So let's go and see how we're gonna do it, what we're gonna eat today. Okay guys, I'm already in the kitchen, so we are going to put this is water. Uh, <laughs> can I call it a, a saucepan or a pot yeah so let us take it like that let me just say uh, it's a pot <laughs> okay so we are going to use this one okay so I'm going to put this on gas that water on gas then uh, we make first make it hot yep. 
So we are gonna first make it hot. So, so let us wait for this water to become hot. Then we make our breakfast. Yeah, it's nice. I don't know how you call it in your language, but I'm going to show you. I know many of you don't know it, but some of you know it. So those who don't know, they're going to learn today. So I'm going to show you how to do it or how it looks like. Then uh, you tell me if you know it or you don't know it, you can comment in the comment section. <laughs> okay, this is the one. So I don't know how you call it in your language, but for me in my language, you call it Osera, you see? So some of them are like, uh, maybe in English it's called millet. Yeah, maybe it's called millet. So that's how I searched on Google when it's called millet. So this one is called Osera in my language. I don't know how you call it in your language. So we are gonna cook this because almost the water is ready. You see how it's looking like, like this. But it's sweet and nice and good for babies. Even for us, like this also is good. Everyone is nice. So this one is called Osera in my language. I don't know how you call it, yeah. But if you cook, maybe if you want to cook one cup, you have to put uh, one spoon. Yeah. Oh, the water is almost this water. Uh, no more water. The one we use for cooking. So this is water. Then you stir this. You make sure it dissolves very well. Okay. So this one is very very nice i'm sure you like it if it's your first time to see this you can go and, 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 and it, uh, you can purchase it anywhere yeah because in arab countries it's there in african countries there are most of the countries is there so after you see that it has dissolved very well so just cross this and you check on our water if it's ready yeah, so this is how it's looking. It's looking like this. After putting water. So we're gonna check on our water and see if it's there, if it's ready. Yeah. So this is our water. It's there. It's already ready. So we are going to take this water and we pour this water in the cup. So our water is already ready. So you're going to take this water and we pour this in the cup. Some they just cook it from down but for me I like it I like to cook it in the, on fire some they just put cold water after putting hot water they dissolve everything then they put hot water that's all like they drink like this but for me I enjoy it more when I put and uh, on fire yeah so I like it more when I put on fire it's almost ready because it doesn't take as long as you put hot water it doesn't take long it doesn't take long yeah to be ready so here like this is ready but for me i like it more you can drink it like this no problem but for me i like it more when i put it on fire so what i'm going to do i'm going to put back in this pot <laughs> so there's more water remaining but it's okay so i'm going to add this here yeah so that i can put it back on fire so i'm going to take my cup I pour this here. All right. Okay. So it's small water. So if you put it on fire, it will come heavy. Okay. Let me show you. See. So if you put it on fire, it will become more heavy and more heavy. Yeah, like before. So you see how it's looking, like this. Mm. You see, we put it on fire when it's watery. So let's some wait for like a few minutes. Yeah. Then we see how it's gonna be looking. So it has started to boil. Okay. Let me first reduce this gas. Okay. So you see, it's becoming heavy and heavy. You see, before it was very very light see so it started to become heavy and heavy if you like you can drink it uh, when we just put uh, hot water in it without putting it on fire also it's nice no problem with it but for me I just like it like this yeah so you see how it's looking now it's heavy it's going back to the way it was 
I switch off. Yeah, it's almost ready. Our breakfast almost ready. So I uh, see. So it's heavy. So the more it stays down, it becomes heavier and heavier. Yeah. So this one, I don't know how you call it in your language, but in my language, I call it Osera. But in other language, I don't know. <laughs> But I know it's in different different places, not only in my country, because I bought this in UAE. So that means it's everywhere. Yeah. So you can prepare it for yourself, you can prepare it for your child, you can prepare it for your baby and your family. Yeah. So let me put this in the cup and we take the breakfast. Anyway, the good thing about this pizzella, you can if you want you can put sugar. If you don't want, you can uh, you can drink it like this. Yeah, so it depends to you. You can put sugar if you don't want. You cannot put sugar. So it depends to you. So let us put it in the cup. Yes, because it's already, it's now ready. So that's how it's looking. Yeah. So our breakfast is ready. So what are you going to eat there? You have some snacks, bread. So it looks like this. So I like it when I put little sugar. So I'll put little sugar, then I drink it like this. Yeah. So that's how it looks like. It's very nice tasting and very good. If you don't like to drink it like this, maybe it's hot, you can also make it. Then uh, after you can put it in the fridge and you drink it when it's cold. Also, it's very, very nice if you drink it when it's cold. Yeah. So it depends to you. So this is mine. So how do you prepare your breakfast? For me, this is what I drink every day. If I don't drink black tea, I drink this. Yeah, so this is my breakfast. So I'll eat, drink this with a uh, blade. And that's all for today's morning. <laughs> it's already afternoon because already I wake up like. Okay, uh, so this is, I'm done. So this is my sugar. So I'm gonna put, I'm not a sugar person. I would put only one spoon. One spoon is enough for me. Yeah, one spoon of sugar. Breakfast is ready. Ooh, la, la, la. So tell me, let us test and see how it's tasting. Mm. <laughs> it's tasting very nice. You see this, my cup? Yeah, this is my cup. It's very, very big, but I like it like this. Yeah. Because in Africa, we like to drink more tea and we don't like to drink it in small cups. <laughs> the difference between Arab countries is that the Arab countries, for them, they drink like maybe coffee, what in small, small cups. Aye. If you go in my country, my dear, if it's to drink tea, we drink tea. If it's to drink water, drink water. Yeah. If it's a cup, it has to be a cup, not a small cup. <laughs> So that's the difference we have. Maybe because uh, in Africa we overwork, so maybe we need uh, to eat to have more energy. Yeah, to have energy so that we can go to work, we work, so the body is always demanding. Yeah, so that's what I think. Because if you don't have too much things to do or too much work to do, uh, the body is not demanding to eat or to drink more. Yeah, so whenever you feel you are thirsty, drink small. Whenever you feel you, are, you, are, you want to eat, you eat small. But in my country, my dear, you have to eat. You have to eat so that you can get strength, you get energy to work. Yeah, so this is my Seda. It's looking very, very nice. Uh, and it's uh, tasting very nice. Yeah, try it. You tell me, try it. I know so many countries, they have this because when I bought this in Arab country here, where I'm staying so uh, that means there are so many places so many countries they have this but maybe some they see it but I don't know how to cook it and I don't know how to it has so many uses but it, that that topic is not for today <laughs> yeah that topic is not for today but it has a lot and a lot very very beautiful and great great uses for this yeah but that topic is not for today but if you know that use you can comment in the comment section and tell me <laughs> maybe some they learn from you but has a lot and beneficial uses if you drink it yeah so that topic is not for today maybe for another day so that's my breakfast anyway i eat for my day of today so and you
what did you eat yeah so i love you so much let me first take my breakfast and then we go in lunch and we see what we gonna eat today what is that so special that we gonna have what some of you don't know and you're gonna learn today okay when you know it but you don't know how to make it okay so let me just take my breakfast and we go straight to sauce for today's video okay my dear darlings breakfast is done so we're going to see what we're gonna eat on lunch yeah today i'm going to prepare something you guys you don't know or some you know but you don't know how to prepare it or, or I don't, you don't know some if they it exists so this is what we have today Ooh. okay this one I have some beans here. <laughs> okay, it's this. Oh, some more. All right. So it's this one. You see it? You see it? You see it? It's like this. Yeah. You see it? We're gonna prepare this. So let me put in this in the plate so you can see very well. Okay. So I'll just put it on the plates so that I can see it's very very well. Yeah, it's this one. So some of you you call this I don't know. First tell me what is this? <laughs> First tell me what is this? For you who know it. Okay, some of you you call this guinnets. Uh some if you say guinnets, they don't understand. They know peanuts. Yeah. So I know someone is there imagining can you cook peanuts like sauce oh yes my darling you can cook peanuts like sauce so this one is blended peanuts mm. you see before or you can call it guinnets mm. so before they are guinnets full so they blend it into this yeah so into powder form so if you blend it it becomes like this and you can cook it very well like sauce yeah so i'm going to cook this with you so that you can tell me if you knew it or no so it looks like this yeah this one is easy to cook very 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 easy because it doesn't need a lot of energy a lot of things a lot of ingredients no no it needs few few things you just put and then you leave it on fire so let's go and see how to prepare this guinness okay you see how it's looking so it's oily yeah because you can see it um you may ask yourself if there is oil no there is no oil it's just oily if you blend it it becomes like this so the more you cook it if you cook it maybe if i'm going to cook it i'll show you by the way let's just go in the video yeah so there is no oil no oil in this no so they just blend it and it turns like this okay so let's go and cook and see how it's gonna look like after we prepare it for the sauce okay <laughs> okay this is what we need only this guinness uh, onion and tomato yeah so i'm going to put half of this one in water in the saucepan so i'll put half of this because i i will not eat all so i'll put half in water also i cut onion i put in water also i cut tomato i put in water so we can start so we can start the procedure okay so this is a uh, peanuts or peanuts i put in the plate also this is a uh, tomato and this is a uh, onion so we gonna put this together here in water like this together so i'm going to use my hands to dissolve this yeah you may ask why I don't use gloves. No need to use gloves because since then, gloves, they have just come because of corona. Okay? So you just have to make sure that your hands are clean so that you can start to mix this with this. So you just have to make sure that your hands are very, very clean so that you can start mixing this. Okay? You squeeze this very well in water. Some of you may say, I don't like it that way. I don't like it. So if you don't like this way, 
So the reason why I put this tomato at the same time is because I don't have blender. Yeah, because I want to squeeze them together. So I don't have blender, but if you have blender, also it's okay. You can put in blender, blend it. Then after uh, mixing this one, the guinness with water, then you can pour the tomato, no problem. But for me, I put it because it's the only way. So I do it in traditional way, like the way we do it at home. Yeah, because uh, some people they don't have blender. So if you have blender, also it's okay. You can do it with blender. So if you don't have blender, you can just mix the way I had. I'll do it. Okay, we are done. So just switch on the gas. Okay, switch on the gas, and then you wait for some few minutes. Don't leave before it starts boiling, because if it boils when we are not here, it may pour down. So you wait for it until it starts boiling. Okay, so when it starts boiling then you you can put it on a small fire then you can leave it so we have to wait until it starts boiling so that one is okay like the way it's boiling that one is okay you can leave it like that so it can stay boiling like that slowly by slowly until it will form its own cream yeah so you can leave it boiling like that slowly and slowly it's ready then you can cook any food rice anything you want then you eat with this one yeah it's very nice and delicious okay so as you have seen everything that's how my day off mode yeah so when i'm off i'm always busy also you have to do this you have to do this you have to do this and that's how my day off moved the whole day working as if i'm at work <laughs> but i love you so much thanks for watching my video thanks for following me don't forget to subscribe and comment down below comment down below and tell me if you know what i prepared today or, to, or what i had today so i love you so much bye bye we'll meet in the next video bye bye